Yo, what is happening, guys, and welcome back to the Unspeed Action Channel. Of course, we're back for another reaction. Or today, yes, that is right, we're back for another Upchurch reaction. And he is this to Tom McDonald again. Yep, that's right. Upchurch released the diss track on Tom, I think, about a week and a half ago or so. Tom never responded. Then we got um, a fan of Upchurch, who's also an artist himself, Just Trey, released four diss tracks on Tom. Tom still didn't respond. So apparently Upchurch dropped this, and then he said, right, he's done with Tom. He ain't replying. He's going to go on to someone else. Um, I feel bad for that poor motherfucker he's going to move on to next. But he's dissing Tom one last time. I assume he's going to go at him for not joining the battle. This is a battle I really wanted to see, but we ain't going to get it, unfortunately. But we're going to get into that. But of course, before we do, as always, hope you all have an amazing day. If you're not, switch that shit the fuck around. Start having an amazing day. Always try to spread positive vibes, entertain, and have fun on this channel. Because that's what it's all about. It's all about the fun and the vibes. Now, I remember, if you all fuck with the vibe, like, comment, and subscribe. The link's up here and down below. You want IRL vlogs content on this bit of vlogs. You want gamer content on this bit of gamer. You want Twitch, TikTok, IG, all this and that. You got that too down there. If you want to see me do more than just react, I really would appreciate it. But yes, up church. This one's there. You just call Tom McDonald this. That is it. And we're going to get into it. We're going to see what else he got to say. And yeah. So, up church. Take it away. Once I record this, I'm going to watch the Super Bowl. Six, one, five. It's like YouTube versus Mozart. Pick his fucking bone apart. Coyote in the hollow when it's dark. My stomach start to bark. This road killed dead. Been dead since the first track. Mickey Thompson pattern slapped all the way down to his ass crack. Five. Okay, so let me let me wind this back a little bit. Uh, we're just gonna go back to the start. <clears throat> Six, one, five. It's like YouTube versus Mozart. Pick his fucking bone apart. Coyote in the hollow when it's dark. My stomach start to bark. So obviously he said pick his phone up, fucking Buddha Park already in the dark. Um, My stomach start to bark because my stomach's looking for my stomach starting to bark because it's it's like coyote, obviously. And then my stomach's starting to bark because it wants the drama, but I'm picking his fucking bone apart like a coyote. Um, Okay. Okay. This road killed dead, been dead since the first track. Mickey Thompson pattern slapped all the way down to his ass crack. So obviously he said he's been dead since the first track. I don't get that Mickey Thompson, but I'll be real. Head ass, you already know about the tall heads. I see sting on your face, barbed wire with the ball bag. Control the situation and his ass cave. Fall back, all there is is water, and he ain't fluid enough to swim. Rap kills with the skills. You a CGI spacecraft, green screen, rhyme zone, algorithm format. Okay, okay, so obviously he had the little bar about Tom's tattoos. He said about the barbed wire ball sack because obviously Tom McDonald has the barbed wire tattoos. Then he started taking the piss out of him. He said that, um, what's it? He turned around and said he ain't 90% water or something like that because he can't swim rat, rat because obviously your body's like 70% water or some shit. So it's like you ain't 70% water because you can't swim rap. Um, but I got gills because I'm breathing underwater. I can swim rap because I got gills. So I'm doing that shit. Okay. And then he said about the, the green screen for Matt Baba. And I'm assuming he's talking about how Tom McDonald, a lot of his videos are used using green screen. I don't know how Upchurch's videos are filmed, but Upchurch probably, I think he goes out and films it in locations where Tom McDonald usually uses a green screen, a set type thing to set up his music videos. So I'm assuming he's taking the piss out of him saying, oh, use a green screen for this instead of going and doing it. Um, Tall heads, I see sting on your face, Bob. What's he called? Tall head, Control the situation in his ass cave. Fall back, all there is is water, and he ain't fluid enough to swim. Rack oh, kills with okay. the skills. You a CGI water. spacecraft, green screen, rhyme zone, algorithm format. Algorithm format because you're doing it for the algorithm because you're not rapping for the right reasons. You're only rapping the way that the algorithm is going to reward you, which is a lot of disses that Upchurch has been throwing at all. I put algae on the stone tab, Raptor in the club, back Jurassic Park, a car in my lot, tow it to Toronto. Facts. Mm, okay. My ink pen a wrist when I clinch it with a mean fist. Hip hop is the art you leaped in with some cheap shit. Met the grill of a redneck driving around in the C10. Screaming white boy a couple of times. Now he automatically thinks we friends. Leave a hog at the farm in the Deceased in my big pen. Got marked with an ink tip. I'm real bored. Flip trick. My style make a trick flip. Is that Katie no L or a revamp of white chick? <laughs> okay. So he turns around again and he mentions that. He says driving around screaming white boys. He said he said that um he thinks because he said white boys a few times. Now we friends. Obviously, Tom and Church were friendly enough before they did a track together. Um he's obviously taking the piss out of Tom McDonald's song, the way he did in the last one, White Boys. Um he made a song called White Boy. Um, and all that shit. And then obviously this one, you got, you got murked with an ink pen. I'm real bored. Flip 
flip trick my style make it trick flip is that katie noel or a revamp of white chicks obviously y'all get the white chicks bar but got murked with an ink pen because you got murked you got killed with an ink pen because i ripped those wraps and killed your ass i like that part that was a nice fucking part um there was a part before that though the C10 screaming white boy a couple times now we automatically think sweet friends leave a hog at the farm end of the deceased in my big friend leave a hog at the farm end of the deceased in my pig pen obviously it's they keep bringing up hog because a hog hangover gang um tom mcdonald has a tattooed here that's obviously his his group of fans um and he's saying hog leave him dead in the pig pen because the hog is a pig so Little bar there as well that he always does. Got marked with an ink tip. I'm real bored. Flip trick. My style make a trick flip. Is that Katie no ill or a revamp of white chick? Transform rappers into looking like my side pit. I be standing in the kitchen eating Canadian bacon strips. And ain't nobody on my wave, so nobody can sink the ship. Hey, pyramid scheme ain't nothing but a weak big Eminem attention. No getting make his name Egypt. I ain't buying bull because I'm well known like a C script. Joke dirt's coming. I'm only dropping some heat shit. That part was nice. Okay. He also mentioned Joe Dirt there. Um, obviously, he said he can Canadian bacon. Tom McDonald's Canadian. He said about Eminem, no attention getting because obviously he's saying Tom Tom McDonald, you're just a fanboy of Eminem and you bought a beat from him and now you can't get attention from him. So you're, no, um, you're just an Eminem, no attention getting. Little bitch. And then obviously, Egypt with the E stand for Eminem. Okay. Oh, and bacon that? strips and ain't nobody on my wave so nobody can sink the, the ship. ship hey pyramid scheme ain't nothing but a weak big eminem attention no getting make his name egypt i ain't buying bull because i'm well known like a c-script joe dirt's comet i'm only dropping some heat shit joe dirt's comet i'm only dropping some heat shit nah i know he had a track no sorry no 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 okay is this is this a callback to him and screw this I actually don't know. Y'all can correct me, but obviously Screw had a diss towards Upchurch called Joe Dirt, and then Upchurch's response was called Joe Meteor, Meteor, obviously, which hits there. So he said about Joe Dirt coming with some heat shit. Is he saying Joe Dirt screws this track towards me, but coming with some heat shit because he replied with Joe Meteor, which is heat. It's going to bang for the earth on fire. It's heat. Is that what he's talking about? But obviously he's referring to the tracks and the name of the track. Y'all can let me know in the comments below. I want to hear it one more time. One second. But a weak big Eminem attention. No getting make his name Egypt. I ain't buying bull because I'm well known like a C script. Joke dirt's coming. I'm only dropping some heat shit. Keep the pans in the cupboard. All my neighbors is by because I'm firing a funky volume and knock off Marcus Hobson. He'll fill it with a L mind. Remember Hop had white eyes. He ain't tell no white lies or hashtag his whole life. It's me slowed down like purple drink and toss Sprite. I'm the hitter in your system. Memphis 12's all night. Dude spent a hundred racks on a shady made beat. Reenacted a classic from the Marshall Mathers. And then he fucked it all up acting like a psycho freak And now his photo in the guard shack somewhere in the deep This is ludicrous Back in 2003 an albino crab apple looking like he's covered in bleach In a simulated ring simulated competition I'm Optimus Prime you optimizing all the opposition Is this I'm Optimus Prime you optimizing all the opposition Oh, that was a nice one. That was a nice Transformers bar, bro. That was fucking nice. Um, and then obviously he took another shot at Tom with the Eminem thing as well. Um, where he turned around and said he mentioned what I said, and I think he mentioned in the other song where he said about buying a beat, you bought a beat from Eminem, and then you fucked it all up because you just tried to be a fanboy, I guess. Church is coming with some fucking like good bars, bro. I really oh, why couldn't we get this this track war, bro? I've said it countless times. I'm a fan of church and I'm a fan of Tom. I just wanted to see two, in my opinion, very talented, skilled artists go head to head. I didn't give a shit what it was about. I didn't give a shit what the backstory was. I just wanted to see two talented artists display their skills and go head to head for our entertainment. That's what I wanted to see. Unfortunately, we didn't get that. <laughs> I understand why Tom didn't reply, to be fair. He said it before in the bite your tongue thing where he turns around and says that he's not going to do it because it's given them what they want, which is attention. So he's not going to diss in the back. So I understand, but it would have been nice to, to get this little diss track war. Love action like a psycho freak. And now his photo in the guard shack somewhere in the deep. This is ludicrous. Back in 2003, an albino crab apple looking like he's covered in bleach. In a simulated ring, simulated competition. I'm Optimus Prime, you optimizing all the opposition. Is this dude a rapper or a politician? Is he AI generated or got tattoos missing? I got the juice, motherfucker, not Shapiro recognition. Got your mama jokes, I got his yama cup of rhyming with the... <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> okay, so obviously he turned around and says, is this dude a rapper or a politician? Because Tom McDonald raps on politics. So is he dude a rapper or a politician? Are you rapping or are you just talking about politics? Okay, and then he obviously said that this guy was it got the Shapiro recognition because obviously Tom McDonald dropped a song called Facts with Ben Shapiro, but he's also taking a shot at that song because he's saying you got Shapiro recognition. Tom McDonald and Ben Shapiro, they were number one, I believe it was, on the iTunes charts for 15 days. I think it was so basically two weeks, and I can't remember how many views, but they have a lot of views on that song. And that's basically him taking a shot, saying you got Shapiro recognition. You wouldn't have got that high on the charts for that long if it wasn't for Ben Shapiro because you got the Shapiro recognition. So he's obviously taking the credit away from Tom and saying you didn't chart, Ben Shapiro did, and you were the feature on your own song, essentially. He's trying to get under Tom's skin. Okay, that, that was a smart one. That was, that was a smart one. Okay. And then you, you got your mama jokes. I got this. You're luckily, whatever the fuck that says, for ramen with the chicken noodles. Okay. Because he cooking. Politician. Is he AI generated or got tattoos missing? I got the juice, motherfucker. Now Shapiro recognition. Got your mama jokes. I got his yarmulke for ramen with the chicken noodles. My shit's so hard written in Roman numerals. Ooh. I kill the beat so much every album having a funeral. Dig a hater out the grave because I'm a DNA consumer. Got a pharaoh producer camera angle be looking lucid. Every move is being made in the way of the future by the way when we get there you still need a hip-hop tutor i'm the shit poop scooper on my record so boost good and lose yourself in the music the moment you don't hit that's why you're never doing show. The can't Apple. even get one shot your verse from the hand of ghost that composition be empty your fucking lifetime my genre of music labeled as a high crime zodiac killer jim and i yanking on your lifeline who wants to be a millionaire for no fucking reason this guy Now Waddle study in Southern Comfort up on his Wi-Fi Go denim on denim like a carny up at the fair ride Cotton candy, your heart popcorn for no show Kick your ass out my house like I'm Earl Winslow Got any cheese? <laughs> okay He, he kind of went hard at the end there When he went into the Eminem Lose Yourself flow Obviously another diss towards Tom McDonald Because he kept mentioning Eminem Then he went into the Eminem Lose Yourself He goes Lose Yourself in the boat And then mentioned about Tom McDonald's flow on that <laughs> Okay Okay, I think I might prefer I think I might think that's a better diss track than the first one I think that's a better diss track than the first one Just from, The first one was quite good I think that's a better one but I'm not too sure. But yeah, that was Upchurch Tom McDonald this. Like I said, someone told me that he apparently said he's not going for Tom anymore, that he's had his thing, he dropped this, this track, and now he's moving on to somebody else. Um, and he really has it out for this person, so I can't wait to see who. But unfortunately, we ain't going to get a Tom reply. We ain't going to get a Tom versus Up Upchurch this track war, which I really wanted. But unfortunately, you don't get everything you want in life. But that was a good diss from Church. It was a good diss. Like I said, it's a shame. But it is what it is. Fair play to Church. If he disses someone else, I actually wonder who it is. Because I know Church has beef with, like, fucking everybody, talk. He's beef with everybody. He ain't going to go for Adam Calhoun, obviously, because him and Adam are still cool, even though he's beef with Tom. Apparently, he has a problem with Struggle Jennings, I think it is, the country singer, or some shit. He might be going for him. I don't know, but I'm excited for it nonetheless. I'm excited to see what happens. I'm excited to see who gets dissed and brought into the fire, brought into the kitchen to get cooked up next. But, hey, hope you all enjoyed, as always. I enjoyed that. Hope you all enjoyed this. Hope you all are finger positive. Hope you all have an amazing day. Hope you all are staying safe. Hope you all enjoyed the reaction. Have a great one. I'll see you in the next one. So, uh, peace. Fearless. Fearless.